cold, but uh, no <laughs> real events uh, affecting the roads this morning, huh? Well, it was a little slippery, I think, in southern Maryland. We only mm -hmm. had some flurries here, officially a trace at BWI Marshall, so it's good news, right? It we is. got through that Absolutely. morning rush hour with just a couple snow flurries around. 31 degrees for the afternoon high today, occurred just before 4 o'clock. 23 the morning low, certainly cold enough to cause some slippery conditions if the storm had come a little farther to the north. And you see the averages now are at 41 and 24. And as I mentioned yesterday, this is the coldest that our average temperatures get. We're in that stretch of January that is typically the coldest time of the year. Average high of 41, average low of 24 will stay there for a couple weeks. And then those numbers will start to slowly inch up just a little bit. And look at the record low, two below zero on this day. Back in 1912. Officially at the airport, then just a trace of snow. Some spots had a little more uh, up in Frederick County, points to the west of us and a little farther south, uh, maybe an inch in some locations. But for the month now, we've only had 2.3 inches of snow officially at the airport, and that's technically a little bit below normal. And so we are pacing just a touch below normal snowfall so far this winter. Last of the rain and snow moving off the mid Atlantic coast. Can't rule out a passing flurry or two around here for the next hour or so, but we should see a gradual decrease in the cloud cover overnight. Which will let the temperatures cool. We're in the 20s now across most areas, low 30s in downtown Baltimore, Cambridge, Salisbury checking in in the mid 30s, 25 out at Oakland and Western Maryland for the rest of the night. Mostly cloudy skies. The normal is 24. We'll be around that by morning. Sunset uh, went down at 5:06, so the days are technically getting a little bit longer. But again, we are in the coldest part of the year for sure. There's that weak area of low pressure moving away. High pressure in New England pushing cold air down the coast. And a fairly quiet weather pattern nationwide now. No big storms to track at this point. It's a little chilly down to the Gulf Coast. Some rain in 44 in New Orleans, but very mild in Miami at 76 degrees. A little clipper to the north doesn't look like it's going to cause us much of a problem. So Insta Weather Plus Futurecast shows the generally dry, chilly conditions that we expect. Heading into Thursday, Friday, and probably Saturday as well. There will be a system passing north of us with a little bit of cloud cover tomorrow and Friday, but doesn't look like it'll be strong enough to produce any kind of precipitation. So enjoy the kind of break in the active winter weather pattern. 36 to 41 tomorrow, partly cloudy skies, west to southwest winds at 5 to 10, sun coming up Thursday morning at 725. In western Maryland, naturally a little bit colder, but for this time of year, 32 is not bad. And then maybe a passing flurry as that system passes north of us on Friday. On the eastern shore, Elkton and Ridgely, about 39 tomorrow, should get into the low 40s Friday into Saturday. And on the coast around Ocean City, as the rain and snow showers move out, temperatures will gradually warm a bit. Partly cloudy, 38 tomorrow, 39 Friday, 41 on Saturday with sunny skies. We are watching a storm system move in here late in the day Sunday. It's probably going to start as rain with temperatures in the 40s. Possibility, though, that it goes over to snow Sunday night into Monday with some flurries lingering. And then it gets kind of chilly again early next week. Highs only in the 30s. All right.